Forced to evacuate, these Starks residents will tell you there's no place like home. It was great to be back home and uh, got to check on our animals, see their home, our house was all right. It's wonderful to be back home, you know, and, and to make sure that everything's pretty much the way we left it. Nine Starks families were forced to leave their homes Thursday afternoon after a damaged wellhead leaked dangerous gas from a faulty valve. It was kind of rough, really, because when they evacuated us, they gave us only moments. Oh, it was terrible. Being away from home, not knowing if we, what we were going to have left when we got back or if we were ever going to get to come back. Most stayed here at the Days Inn Hotel in Orange, Texas, but Darlisa Taylor ended up evacuating to her parents' house. Taylor says she hasn't been feeling well since she was potentially exposed to dangerous fumes. been itching head to toe head to toe with no explanation and nothing has been able to stop it. Keith Hyatt is also worried. His wife saw the smoke and drove through it. When she drove through it and it got in her throat and she could taste that stuff and uh, then uh, some guy, she called 911 and the man told her she needed to leave. It was a very volatile situation. Things are back to normal here at the Wellhead site but now crews are working on environmental cleanup. With residents back home, some are still very concerned with their living conditions. We're really wondering and worried about the impact it's going to have. Well, it's happened now. Now we're going to be very leery of it. I'm going to always be worried about it now. We need those questions addressed. Someone needs to let us know something. There have been no reports of serious injuries. Meanwhile, residents wait for answers while the matter for now remains under investigation. At your service in Starks, Charlie Bartlett, KPLC 7 News. Officials say the all clear was given around 11.30 this morning. We'll